thanks for watching my video today i'm going to discuss permutation uh, formula okay formula for permutation and first of all let me explain about permutation okay permutation mean it is just an arrangement of object okay in a definite order taken r at a time r uh, taken uh, r mean just uh, taken sum or or all, all at a time okay then is what we call permutation so in order to under, in order to derive this I'm going to take some example here okay let me draw here one we have three box okay and let's name them a b c okay I'm going to name them a b c and we are going to take and this three box two at a time okay which means two box okay I'm going to take two at a time this is first box second box so I'm going to take uh, out of three I'm going to take two at a time that mean what does it mean that I can fill the first box okay I can fill the first box in whether a or b or c i can feel three isn't it i can feel uh, in the first box i can feel a or b or c so we have three options okay we have three options to fill it so let me say first box is let's say a let's name is a okay i feel this first box a okay a is already cancer so in the second box i have if out of three one uh, one is already filled okay that means we have two box left that means in the second box here we can fill either uh, c or b okay i can fill uh, b or so or c so let me fill c here that means if i fill uh, we have two uh, we left two okay so that means i have two options to fill it in here okay that means the permutation in is 6 then is let me show here that we are taking 2 at a time okay a b b c a c c a c b b a which is 6 i can arrange them in 6 different way now Consider that this is for uh, three, okay, three box. Consider for, let's say this is first, second, third. For an uh, R boxes, okay. This box is for R. For R boxes, okay. We can fill how much? For R, R boxes, we can fill the first box by an, isn't it? And so, so let me explain. The number of permutation of an object, okay? We take here an object already. So, an object taken r in a time, okay? Taken r in a time is same as finding the number of ways in which r place can be filled up by r objects out of an object at r disposal. So, since one of the n object can be placed in the first place, it can be done in unways okay first box we can fill up in unways let me write here we can fill up in unways and second box we can fill up in n minus one and third box we can fill up in n minus two and so on so and the r term we can fill up in n minus what r minus one okay or which is n minus r plus one which is same as this one so the permutation so n n minus 1 n minus 2 and so on n minus r plus 1 which is what permutation permutation of n r Okay, now let's simplify here. Uh, 
n n minus 1 n minus 2 so on n minus r plus 1 so now I'm going to multiply by n minus r n minus r plus 1 and so on up to 3 2 1 okay it will go on over since I multiply here I'm going to multiply in the denominator or so okay one is 3 factorial okay. 3 factorial means 3 into 2 into 1 okay and here therefore and permutation of R or P and R is what this is one is this and n minus one minus two and minus r plus one and minus r and minus r plus one three two one which is same as this one so which is this is n times am I right and factorial and what is the denominator here this one is just n minus r factorial so which is our answer